YouTube, what you're looking at is the Dell D630 and the thing has a broken hard drive. So we're going to replace the hard drive of this laptop. In fact, you know, this is a laptop that will let you replace the hard drive really easy. So first thing that we're going to do, of course, is remove the battery, just in case. Okay. We put it aside, we also have a SATA drive and we have a, a cross a screwdriver, I think it's called a Phillips screwdriver. So that's what we're going to use. And uh, there you can see three screws, so we're going to loosen them up. And these screws are holding the bay and the drive kind of in the laptop because we will slide it out of the laptop and in fact this is a replacement that can be done under 10 minutes so it's no big deal this third screw was kinda inside not even sure if it's also a cross can't see anything it's kinda dark so let's put some light on there we must really inspect that. Ah, I see it. It's a star screwdriver, a uh, screw, but it's it's already loosened. I'm just gonna flip the thing over and get the screw out because this is ridiculous. There it is. So now that we remove the screws, let me turn off my light again. <laughs> so there, hoppa. We can simply slide out the hard drive. You see that? It comes straight out. And by turning it around, you will see that it's kind of connected with two clips that fits in the two holes of the of the drive if you take another drive and you also put it in the same direction of of the of the old drive also with the top up you can simply click in the holder of the drive and then of course it's very common that you will slide the drive back in make sure you fit it good lift it up a little bit there just to fit it in don't push it it must go in really easy just lift it up there a little bit so like that so you can push it in and now we can put back the screws and in fact now we just replaced a hard drive uh, we upgraded the hard drive of the Dell D630 from 80 gigabytes to 160 gigabytes, and that will give this thing a new life. Of course, we will install uh, Linux on this thing, and uh, yeah, it will be uh, running, I think, Linux Mint or so. It's not my laptop, it's from Millie, and uh, well, <laughs> she was completely... Uh, confused she said my laptop my laptop I said your hard drive just crashed we need to find another hard drive so I found her another hard drive and we just popped it in and now the machine is uh, yeah it's back to life it has a hard drive again so that's how to replace the hard drive we put back the battery and that's it we can now go ahead and Go check into the bias and see if the hard drive was found. But of course it will be found because the hard drive is just fine. There is nothing on the hard drive so we're gonna give it a little reboot there. Ok. 
okay let's restart control alt delete and we go into the bias and uh, we can already see that the drive is uh, found taking a look at the bias this bias is kind of yeah it's kind of advanced eh? you can really change a lot of things in the Dell D630 I think it's uh, for now even now 2015 still a very good laptop there is uh, also software out there special boot uh, software uh, add-on for the Chameleon bootloader to you know install Mac OS X on this thing and it will run fantastic because uh, I did it as well so this is not a bad laptop at all and if you can find one you know Dell D series D630 the D830 well I can tell you out of experience that these laptops are pretty good they're not so fast with rendering video you know but uh, for normal usage uh, music recording DJing and things like that it's really good well peeps that was it uh, if you think this video was cool Please like, subscribe and love to see you in my next video again.